You are the treasure that I sit. You were close to me, yet I did not know the love that I seek for many years. Why do I have this feeling like something is not right? Marion is in love with my closest friend's husband. And who are you referring to as a prostitute? If not for the vows I made before God, I would have done something stupid. Who the hell you open your mouth? You don't know this person. It will never be again. It comes back to me. Tell me he's dead. They missed him. Shit! Alice! Alice, long time. You need to shut up. Where is Uncle Man? Oh. I think he's in his room sleeping. The Gen, the Gen Production, production yeah. in collaboration with Lion Mount Films, presents the Insolent King. I'm a team. I'm a team here. They team me. I'm Buga the Lion. A Sierra Leonean movie, The Insolent King, or by Kasa the Second, is the king of Maban Kingdom. He's been enjoying his kingship together with his wife, Queen Yayo, and Princess Zainab, their only daughter. But things turned upside down for him when his subjects began to pressure him to marry another wife who will bear him a male child that will succeed him since Queen Yayo is unable to bear a male child. The Insolent Queen or by Casa the Second, bowed to the wish of the people and married the devil's younger sister, Mambura. Mambura! Mambura! Why don't you even sleep? You are two idiots. I'm the special gift of the spirit. Insultingly contentious in speech and go conduct. And very insolent. And call her a good queen. Climogene. Why have you decided to be insolent? And when can you allow your blood to express her? The insolent queen. Say elephant aid not a picking load. This is about five couple which have gone on one island we get all teen alive. Now they then go find out say the island says self gag bongo so. I know you too well. I know when you then lie for when you then send it to. <laughs> not only you know they control me life. May not just left to you. Married me. What some breakfast is Abby? You want shoes it Abby? You what is it? Cause you there for the beach woman, Tony. Chris Michelle Williams, The Pride of Sierra Leone presents Temptation Island, another blockbuster movie featuring an all Sierra Leonean cast, starring TJ Cole, Christiana Kamara, Mafa Sise, Henrietta Bawa, Daniel Mosire, Donnell Soiree, and Medman. Temptation Island, produced by Papa Chendika and Evelyn Makwa, and directed by award-winning Nigeria Wizkid, Osita Okoli. Temptation Island is marketed and distributed worldwide by Chris Marcel Films. 164 Secular Road, Freetown. Temptation. Who oh, said that to the birds, TV? Are you aware that the news about your wedding is all around town? And for you to cancel this wedding will not just affect Janet, but your entire family. <laughs> Next time, you try it. I don't date cultists. I have found someone that I truly love. You want to win share at the same time?
Or have you ever considered the relationship between I and the vice president? When I close my eyes, the president saw. This is two months ago. What is he up to? <laughs> tell them I love them huh? and tell them I died to save them. The president saw. Starry, Eleanor Ijao, Eleanor Samba, Demona Kamara, Kinabu Mascot Gan, Evelyn O. Egodos. Written and directed by Alfred O. Luko. Produced by Evelyn O. Egodos. The question song, Proudly Sun Valley. Don't miss it. Don't miss it. Don't miss it. Who can say that to the Bart TV? Are you aware that the news about your wedding is all around town? And for you to cancel this wedding will not just affect Janet, but your entire family! Next time, you try it. Police Divine Production present the President's Talk and all single unit movies. I don't date cultists. I have found someone that I truly love. You want to win share at this place? Or have you ever considered the relationship between I and the Vice President? When I close my eyes, the president saw. This is too much to your wedding. Up to now, the position pass, and I'm ready. What is he up to? <laughs> tell them I love them, huh? and tell them I died to save them. The president saw. Starry, Eleanor Ijao, Eleanor Samba, Demona Kamara, Kinabu Mascot Gan, Evelyn O. Egodos. Written and directed by Alfred O. Luko. Produced by Evelyn O. Egodos. Question song, Proudly Sun Valley. Don't miss it. Don't miss it. Don't miss it. Amphora. She threw him out of the throne, but fate brings them back together. Amphora. The mark. The mark brings back bitter memories. It's the Bamboo Production in this All Sun Valley movie. Amphora. The mark. The mark. The mark. In 1840, this tragedy was the crime of the century. Amphora. The mark. The mark. Kanda Yakuba's love and trust for his first wife, Bumposo. Married. Now, like empty box. Where are you, they put? You they pull. If you they pull, you know they put. Now, so you go empty. You, you know, get one sense. Shattered his dream of getting a son to succeed him when he learned that Yenke and his second wife, who goes mad on delivery, had delivered a dog. Why and how it happened cannot be told by even the gods and the wisest men in the land. Emperor, the mark. The Mark, The Mark, written and directed by General Abu Sankar. Amphora, The Mark, The Mark, The Mark, starring John Esila, Magdalene Wilson Cole, Zainab Fufana, Javier Tumansare, and Hopeful Abu Musa. Amphora, The Mark, The Mark, The Mark, introducing Kadi Kobia and Sonke Kamara. Amphora, The Mark, the mark, the mark. Watch out, coming soon. It's our Sun Valley. Williams, you cannot step on the tail of a lion and go free. I am the lion. 
and I know you are true. But believe me, sir, I am a bond. What? Do you think you are smart?
Fatu put the gong with it. Fatu put the Fatu put the gong with it. 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 Fatu put the the and tradition of our ancestors to offer blood sacrifice <laughs> to the gods of our land. Let the air of Lebe home be pure and free of all detestable things. Bring her to the shrine. Let the sacrifice go on.
Even the sweet smell of your skin cannot hide away from me, my love, Jose. Wow! How come you are so much sensitive to my smell? Why not? <laughs> come <on>. <laughs> <laughs> so, tell me, how did you spend the day? Where did you go and what did you eat? The day is not too good for me. <laughs> Bine. Why are you laughing? Oh, I'm laughing here. Yeah. Is it? Um, it's my grandmother. She once told me that love is everything and everything is love. Is it true, Gabi? Wrong. Um, okay, I'm very sorry, okay? <sighs> what is wrong, Kami? <sighs> oh, okay. Have a seat, please. Please. 
<sighs> um, I have been here for so long. And you quite know that we're supposed to meet here. Yes, of course. That is true. You know, Camila, this is a village community. Mm -hmm. And I have to take my time and be careful of village gossip. Because I don't like anything to destroy our relationship. Okay? I'm just... Just... What are I'm not in the mood for that one, as for now. Why? Just shut up your mouth. Wrong. Jose, I think this is the right time for me to get to shut up your mouth and listen to me, okay? Understand the sudden change. And why must you speak like this, Captain? Shh. Why are you asking me short a question like that? After you have realized that the gossip is all over this village, that Chief Kukwe Manso is about taking a second wife, and which is you. I know that. Please. Please, don't. Don't let this. Don't let this trouble your mind, Captain. Okay? I love you with every breath that I take. Listen. It's a promise. That I will do anything in my powers to convince my parents to see you there. Deep in my heart. You go grab and say it's not my choice, but you. Just shut up. Pussy. What are you saying? And not a stranger in this land. <laughs> and with the might and power of Chief Kokoyaman, so your parents can't even dare to think of refusing him. Hello. Hello. Oh, please. Come now. Come now and give me some time with my parents. I don't want to do to let them see you with me. See you for what? Me, see him for what? <laughs> now look. I really want to see how you can turn in Chief Kokoya's power. We are in every parent in this land. We desire him to become the heir. And besides, it is the highest title owner in this land that ever spread beyond the city. So that gives him the power of my wish of getting married. Yes. <laughs> look, you know, just, just get up and listen to me. You don't mind. You better take your stupid self out here and look for somebody else and let me have a piece of me in this land. The guy made me say Don't do this to me, Captain. Don't do this to me. I love you. Don't do this to me, Thank <laughs> you. 
O sea. Es que Esto te cuadro, ¿ok? I had wanted to tell you something, but I'm afraid. Come on, speak up. Is that you really love me? Yes, I love you. Will you do anything for me? Anything, anything for my little kid sister. If it costs me to lay down my life for her, I will surely do. Are you sure? Quite sure. Star, I want you. Oh, come on, speak up. <laughs> to get married to the chief. What? Yes, sister! Cobra, chief is old enough to be called my father. I won't... But you say you love me. Yes, of course, I say. And you do anything for me, Yes! Cobra, but in this case, I can't. Are you out of your senses? Do you know the implication of what you are saying? But sister, why? Fine. Cobra, marriage is a long-lasting relationship. You don't know that. Chief Cobra is old enough to be called my father. How can I marry the man who is old enough to be my father? I can't to so satisfy your selfish desire. Then you don't love me, sister. Fine. Excuse me. Fine. She's called Cobra. I love her so much. And I don't want to hurt her. Yes, I've agreed to marry the chief. I will marry the chief. Can you not give me a hug? Do you really mean it? Yes. I will. I will marry the chief. Sister. Yes? Are you serious? I'm serious. I'm, I'm, I'm serious. Ah! <laughs> Yes, I know how to do this work. Sorry, Bundu, sorry, Bundu. Yeah. My husband. Yes, my wife. Yes, my Good morning. Yes. <laughs> yeah, what did you prepare for me this morning? I have nicely prepared the hot light for my new husband. <laughs> okay, okay, thank you so much. Yes, ladies, down beside yes, me. Yes, my husband. Okay, you there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Let's see. Why are you always so hard to be? In time to a husband's heart. Yes. Every good housewife uh -huh. must be so. Okay. The easiest way to a man's heart must be his stomach. <laughs> yes, yeah, you are quite right. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yes. <laughs> Let me go and prepare the kitchen. I'll be good. Okay, okay. Let me. But, but you, you forget to bring the. Why is this bone? You want me to eat with my hand? Okay. Okay. S P O O N. Ah, don't worry, don't worry. Yes. <laughs> ah, yes. Mm hmm. Good food. Body. <laughs> Are 
Oh, Tim, Piari. Piari, second. Okay. To Pia. Thank you. Our noble chief have asked me to extend his greeting to you. Chief Kukuramaso of Libesegamo. Yes. Long live the thrones of Libesegamo. May the gods of our ancestors continue to keep us well. The chief sent me here to remind you of his words. Mm. Yes. I understand well, my son. Tell my noble chief is nothing big. For the cousins of our land, permit him to accuse as many wives go within his chiefdom of every household. Tell him to make all necessary preparation for the marriage. Go well, my son. Thank you. I will lay your message to the chief. Goodbye. Bye. Yes. Wara! Yamara! Yes, ma'am! They know, they know! Good, good news! <laughs> yes! Good news! Good news! Good news, yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Chief Kokoran's message has just left here. Mm -hmm. He sent it to remind us of something. Can you remember? About our daughter. Yes. Mm -hmm. Sent it to remind us of marrying our daughter. <laughs> oh! <laughs> The blessings of our forefathers yes. truly brings to us the smile of each day. Mm -hmm. So we will do my husband. Mm -hmm. So Chief Kukurama so really mean it. Must you expect him to make a joke out of it? He made it. Not that my husband. <laughs> what is it? But there are so many beautiful girls in the Besega mm -hmm. A more lucky household. Uh -huh. Our daughter Posse Maskant has said very fortunate. Very fortunate. But look. Hmm. Wara, yeah. something puzzles me about Posse. What is it? She always frowned at me. <laughs> always frowned at me whenever I discuss the chief proposal with her. That is my problem. Yes. What is responsible for that? Can you tell her? It's all because mm. she insists in that fatal boy who boy? called himself a hunter. Which boy? Cabinet. You mean the cabinet? Yes. Cabinet still after my daughter? Yes, my husband. That idiot, that stretcher, that bastard, that son of a beast. What? In fact, what? Yeah, yeah. some of the girls told me this morning uh -huh. how she always sneak out of the moonlight stand and almost spend the rest of the night with Cabernet in the nearby bush. Oh. Yes. The cause of her father. Why, why is she? Why, why, why is she? She's call her for me. She's coming. Quickly call her for me. Come on, meet me here. Come on, come on, come yeah, yeah. Come on, put it down. 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 Put and if you don't know, if you don't know that the paramount chief has right to choose as many wives as you could of it, from any household of his chiefdom. And if I refuse? Shut this stupid mouth of yours, Posse. Do you actually know what it means to refuse the chief proposal? No, you can't do this to us. Yes. Let me tell you, Posse. Have you forgotten that we are ruled by customs and traditions of our forefathers? So you have forgotten. Papa, this has nothing to do with my personal life, okay? I mean, since my childhood and up to now, I've always been a perfect and humble gentle girl. So, I've never broken a taboo, and I possibly never break a taboo in this land. Look at you, look at you, eh? Let me tell you, our customs are tradition are the laws. If you refuse to marry the chief, then you have broken the laws. Yes? Yes, my daughter. You will either be banished from this land to another land or forever remain unmarried till you die. That is not all. That is not listen to me again. That is not all. This is very carefully. No man in the will ever speak to you. I cannot talk of marriage. Oh, you prefer not to bear a chair in your womb? No, my daughter. Don't do this to us. I need to talk to you. Come. Come. No, Papa, we eat me. We will not sit you. Come. We will. I want Take this food from here. Take it from here. Take it from Come here. Come and sit down, my daughter. Take this food from here. Come and sit down. We want to talk to you, please. Sit down.
My husband. Yes. We need to talk to her. Will you talk to her? It is not easy for nowadays children. We need to talk to her, please. Yeah, you the mother responsible for all this type of things. Yes. Yes, you talk to her. What say? Mm. Miss Mama. You know your father and I farm no more. And it is not easy for us to have our daily bread these days. Please, my daughter. Allow the primary chief to marry you. Mama, you are talking of your own. What about me? Think about me. I don't love the man. The man is old for me. He's old to be called my father. I love cabinet. You I know. Know. No, 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 no. <laughs> I know my daughter, but please allow the paramount chief to marry you. You will not regret. Please obey and accept the traditions of the land. Please. Is that okay? Please, my daughter. Okay. Yes. Papa. Yes. Mama. I will marry the chief. <laughs> Thank you, my daughter. That is what I want to hear from you, you, my daughter. May the gods of this land bless your marriage and bless your womb. Yes, Mama. Elders of Libby Sengahun land, I greet you all. I summon you here all this morning to seek your advice. Yes, why is it that? A bird cannot fly without its wings. This means that our chiefdom can only wreck without the customs and traditions of our ancestors. Therefore, my elders, I want you all to reason well with me and share my pain. <laughs> How could one imagine a man of my status without having a single child to call my own? Yes, I know she <coughs> oh, boy. Chief of this land that spreads beyond good and evil. Yes. The present gods of Libisi Gahun are the same gods of our forefathers. They have never slept or winked their eyes just to see their children dwell in harmony. Chief them elders of Libisi Gahun. We must find a solution to this. Our chief, fellow elders, Balamol is correct. The gods have already spoken. It is left with us to read the lines on the walls. But why do we need to bring the names of the gods here again? We must find a solution. Yes, you are quite right, Odura. The girls have already spoken. We all know that Chief Kokora Manso loves his wife so much that. He did not want any other woman to share with her. But if Yankade Maso cannot give him a child for now, who will succeed the chief tomorrow? He must take another wife. And indeed, he must marry another wife. Yes, I am sure that Yes, fellow elders, he is correct. It is better for the chief to have two wives and one child than to have one wife and no child. Yes. yes. Who do you think will succeed you after? Hobai, you just have to. She who carries pregnancy must be ready to accept it bad pains. Elders of Libby Senga home, may the gods of our ancestors continue to unite us and give us abundant blessing. Oh. I have heard you all and realize every reason to take a second wife. In this case, I have already made a choice. 
And the lucky one is the daughter of Suribundu and Yawara. <laughs> Wait, my chief. Are you talking about their eldest daughter, Posse? Yes, you are right, Abukasa. <laughs> her parents have already informed her. And the rest is left on my own. Him and you him. shout your name. Tell your son to stay away from my daughter. If you don't want to see him dancing naked in this town of Lebesegaon. Yes, you know, you know that this is Lebesegaon. Well, no one what he said to do evil. Yes. Oh, to Fasu. Then what does Kabine really want behind that girl by now? Well, you should be asking yourself. Ask yourself. Let me tell you, my daughter is getting married to the great paramount chief of this land. In 10 days time. What? Yes? And if, if Kokorama so learned that your son is a pig that sneaks his nose after he's belong, then you forget that you have a son called Kabine. Because my daughter was born for titled men like Chief Kokorama so. Not coward pig like Kabine. Yes, Kabine. Yes. I shall do everything in my past to see that my son stay up from your daughter. He's my only child, and I don't want his death destroyed by wicked men like you. Do it fast, do it fast. Let me tell you, do it fast, because our forefather said, if a cockroach wants to destroy its life, it gets into the bottle of palm oil. Do it fast, oh! Hey, 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 come, come. Send that do it fast, fast, do it fast. For my son. Okay, <coughs> okay. Send that okay. To stay away okay. From my son. do it fast. Oh, oh, help me get it. you against his daughter for the last time. There are more beautiful guys in the Sudan. Why can't you look for someone else and at least have a peace of mind with No, Mama. Mama, look. Mama. You know love does not come in it. And you only follow your heart where it leads you to, Mama. You quite know this. Mama, cabinet. Chief Konkura Maso has just chosen Posse to be his second wife. What? In fact, Posse's father threatened to see you dancing naked around this town. No. Please, my No, Mama, no. Mama, they away from his daughter. Come, let me tell you. Come. That man is evil. And? Mama, please. Mama, please, no. It's over. It's over between me. Come on, okay. Get off my son. Get off. Go in and eat your food. Get off.
Yakadi. Yakadi, what's the problem? What's the problem, Yakadi? <laughs> you always swear by the gods to have me alone. Why? Why, Kokura? Now you tell me why. Yakadi, I still have you alone. And I will forever have you alone. I only decided to take a second wife just to provide for me a child. That is all. But my whole attention is on you. But I have served you for quite a long time now and could have wished for my own child to rule this land after you. Kokora, why? Why don't you be patient and wait for the gods to decide? Tell me why. But Yakadi, you know the custom and tradition of this land that a man of higher title must have a son to learn him the secret of this land and succeed him after. Even if you don't have a son to rule this land, you will still be honored, Elibi Singer. Oh, no, that's what! When another woman's womb is going to produce the next ruler of this land, and even I, the great Yankade Kokora Maso, May be forced to bow down for her. You tell me. Let's hope for the gods to bless a woman. Be it first or second, a male or female, I will make sure that he or she rule the land of Libby Singer. Are you sure? I'm really sure. Tell me, are you really sure? You know, I always stand on my own. Great Kabonka! Great Kabonka! <laughs> Welcome, my daughter! Have your seats. Does not leave its all for nothing. Indeed! Yakare Kokura Mansu, you have a battle to fight! A battle? You're supposed to know that the great chief, Kokura Mansu, is about taking a new wife home. 
I should get pregnant with a male child in her womb. Kabunka, can you help me find a solution? I mean, whatever that could save my dignity and restore my pride, I too must have a child, whether first or second, male or female. May the gods be praised. You will conceive and have a male child, but until another woman first conceives for your husband. That which will be great. So rule Libesi Gahun in its inspiration. He who speaks to the gods and hears from them. I still plead for my own child to rule this land after his father. Is this forbidden? Yes, Yakadi, it is forbidden. It says beyond the powers of the gods. Not even the gods will tamper with such inspiration. Yes, not even the gods will tamper with such inspiration. It is beyond their powers. It is beyond their powers. Inspiration. Oh, gods of our land. The gods of our land. Save me. Oh, the gods of our land. Save me. I greet you all. I now give you the scholar. As a sign, she is the second wife of Chief Kokora. Thank you, Chief Priest. I now hand over my daughter to the great paramount chief of this land, that is Chief Kokora Mansu. meet your husband. Chief Kokora Manso, I now hand over to you the royal beads to put it on your second wife. Great Kabonka, may the gods of our forefathers 
continue to bless us and bless this marriage. I appreciate this marriage wholeheartedly. I today declare Posse to be a second wife to me next to your caddy. I now declare that the celebration may continue. Because you know how to do it. Mm. Yes, Bunduka. Mm -hmm. Believe me, Bunduka. You can do it 20 times stronger than that of my lazy husband. Sure. Whom I regret marrying. Why? He can only display his neck in beating drums. Beating drums? Yeah, beating drums. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I don't know which drums you are talking about. The tabula here. All I'm talking about. The drums for Chief Shh. Shh. Mm -hmm. Keep your mouth shut. Don't you know that what we are doing is a tabula? I am married. And you are not. If we are caught, then I must be the one to face the punishment. Of course you are. Or you want to see me banished? No. Okay. From the musical? Or give my only child to the gods a sacrifice? God forbid. What 
is it? Theater. So it was you coming? Yes. You made me scared. I thought I was alone in this journey. You are not alone. I can see now. You are looking good. Thank you. Why were you scared when you had my steps behind you? <laughs> Frankly speaking, I thought you were on it again. Today we are on it? Who? Oh. Hey. Don't you hear or see them? You are <laughs> always full with little pieces of it. No, you will say that. What is it that it makes my hair and eyes this time? A lot. Sarata, you know that my hair and eyes have always been wide open. I don't think so. Why? Because you have been a little inattentive not to have noticed recent happenings. I ran our famous Nibisi Gahmi, especially with our so-called happily married couple. There you go, Siagata. Woman of all news in Nibisi Gahmi. <laughs> That's me. Always full of riddles. That's me. My sister. Mm -hmm. Tia you again. What is wrong with Tia you? The heaven of all young girls and the most admired married couple. Mm -hmm. It's a love with me. Bunduka? Yes, Bunduka. But what is wrong with your relationship? Ah? Uh huh. Siata. Did I hear you saying what is wrong with the relationship? Hmm. Hey, Siata. Uh huh. A boy whose childhood Tia you saw is now making use. Rather, she's showing a womanhood. Don't you find anything wrong with that relationship? I find. I see something wrong with that relationship. <laughs> of our land. Save us. What has our world turned into? Experiencing short immorality and social decadence. By the way, has her husband heard about this adulterous behavior? Well, he pretend not to know because it is too disgraceful. Oshina Olamba. Yes. I heard the chief prince has sent Kokura Manso to inform him about her angry regards to her. Why should this be related, Chief Kukura? By no mm -hmm. less a person but the Chief Prince. Has she been the first or only one to be unfaithful in her marriage? Or was it because it was Bunduka and not an elder person among them? Mm -hmm. My sister, let me bring into our minds that this is land of Lebeseka. We are policy and not maintain. <laughs> that is another issue. We need to seek divine intervention from the gods. Exactly. Gradually, one is becoming slave to traditional belief and superstition. Really? By the way, what punishment is degree by the mouthpiece of the gods? <laughs> what is behind the consequences? Consequences? Yes. Banishments, of course. Okay. Tia, you shall be banished from this land. And Bunduka will have to stay one week in the shrine of Abu. Isn't that punishment too much for the crime committed by children of this land? My mm -hmm. sister, I have no power on my own. I'm not questioning the decision of our gods. Unlike other acts of unfaithfulness or adultery performed by us. But it is woman that Tia you and Bunduka we are caught right in the sacred bush. It's believed, Kabonka, that this has been their practice. Yes, it has been their practice. Abomination. Abomination. <laughs> My ears are well filled with information and by the woman of all you. news in the district of our village. Let me help you. The children, too sorry for the children in this line of hunger. Mm -hmm. You are enjoying my bunch of food, not too, too heavy. Why? Oh my.
Good morning. What is good about the money? Now you tell me what is good about this money? Shameless dog. Are you not ashamed of yourself? Why can't you look for your age mates and get married to them? Except my old man. Is it my old man that you want? Just take a look at yourself. Shameless dog. You look at yourself. Take a look. Oh, you're spitting on me. Because I'm talking to you, so you're spitting on me. No way for me. I greet you as well, Yakadi. So how has been your day? Well, everything is fine. That's good. We give praise to the gods of our land. Indeed. Have a seat. Thank you, great one. Oh, the gods are wise. Indeed, the gods are really wise. It is best known to the gods why they cannot give us a single child up to this day. Yet we have a lifetime to share. So what do you really mean, Yakadi? It would have been good for you not to take into now. Now, you have made a bad choice. How? Ask your guards to check everywhere in this compound and see if you can find your posse around. It is not possible, Yakadi. It is possible. It is not possible. Sneak out of this compound to get you a child. No. Because it is all you want. Mind your tongue. I hate being ridiculed. Girls! Yes, get one. Search every corner in this compound for my wife, Posse. I'll report now. Go yes. immediately. Yes, get one. My chief, let me check at our father's house and see if I can find her there. You can go. Thank you. Go back and tell the chief that she's nowhere around. Go at once. And where is she? She's nowhere in this compound. Great one. Are you sure? Did you do a search well? Go yet, great Kokara. We we'll search every corner in this compound. My chief, she cannot even be found in her father's house. Really? Uh -huh. I search everywhere in her father's house, she, but she cannot be found. Sorry! Sorry! Go and strike the drum. The whole land of Libisengong must hear this. She must be disgraced and banished. I said go. Go now, I say. Go nowhere. For the gods are not partakers of such things. Chief Kokora, your wife has not gone anywhere. She is at the back of the house. Something is strong. 
goblin has. The gods forbid it. Yes. Let's get on. Follow me. You honor my husband. I see. I sense some worried in your looks. Is anything the matter? You have been here all along? Yes, my husband. Um, I woke up feeling upset and choked. So I decided to use the backyard and have a quiet moment. Girls! Yes, get one. Did you search well? You felt the pigs. I wish the gods to strike you dead right before me here. But, but my husband, Yakari, your wife, came this way and saw me sitting. Are you sure? I swear by the gods of this land, she came this way and saw me sitting here. Let's go. I'm glad you are back. Shut up! What you wish for yourself, you must wish for others. You have to be very careful with your behavior on these days, or else I banish you off the land of living on forever. My chief, when did you start talking to me with no bit of hesitation? You deserve it. You know I hate to be deceived. You told me that you didn't see Posse at the back of the ox. Get me right, my chief. I did go. I never noticed her. Or else I should have brought it to your knowledge. However, my chief, forgive me. You are forgiven. <laughs> Is it not enough that you have explained the truth to me? You make an ungrateful husband, Kokora. Kokora. <laughs> Indeed, you make an ungrateful husband. Is it because you have got a new wife and I am now like the witch in your garden? But don't forget, I made you what you are today. I sacrificed my womb for you to be the great chief Kokora Maso of today. Banish me from Lebisengaun forever. Then I shall go away with my reward. Why must I, in fact, frame up Posse? I did go around the back of your heart, but did not set my eyes on her. Well, maybe it could be a misconception of the whole thing. Yakadi, forgive me for once. <laughs> You bloody swine. You caused me to hurt my first wife. Don't you know that bad manners corrupt good things? I brought you into this house only to provide for me a child. That is all. <laughs> but I love my wife that even in her barrenness. <laughs> Anytime you try anything funny, <laughs> the ghosts have spoken, people of Lebesi Gamun land. This stubborn child has angered the gods. It is known all over Lebesi. 
ese gahun lang. That no one, yes, no one must go around the shrine. <laughs> Except I, the great Kabonka, keeper of the shrine. Not even the great Kokora must go around the shrine. She must be thrown into the forest. <laughs> I beg for mercy. <laughs> Bonka. <laughs> you know that my mother is an old widow. <laughs> I am an only child. <laughs> of Enel, the God, and the land. Great one, you are the one who listen and speak to the God of this land. I mean, Tell the girls that this child is an oven and, and I sad I'm a story. <coughs> I mean, I'm pleading over her condemnation. Cause must be massive. Yes. Cause must be massive. You have done it against Sandama. Even at your age, you are causing so much trouble in this land. He is still troublesome. Sandama, that is why you've been asked out of this court of elders. Sandama, you must pay for this. Enough is enough! Sandama! You are banished! 
Uh. It is because of this that this child must now be sacrificed oh. in order to appease the gods. Yes, you should take my life also, if you like. Cut my throat fell over my head. You, but your mouth, less gods are dead gods. They are dead gods. There is a living god somewhere. One day, if we send someone, <coughs> I mean someone, to redeem this land out of sin and bondage, you must let go. Wicked people. I said it. Sandaba! You must die. You shall be burned down to ashes. Yes. Even your carcass will not remain in this land. Yes. 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 Girls, take them away. You wicked people. You get killed. Spirit of the water. I have come to reverse my covenant with you. Spirit of the water, I have come to retrieve my womb that I exchanged some time ago to make my husband the most powerful man ever to rule the land of Lebesengaun. Is there anything else that I could give as a sacrifice to you? Yes! You must give, give. A, baby a baby boy! Tony River! We did with three days! I prefer it, spirit of the water. It shall be done. No one must tamper with the customs and traditions of this land. Our ancestors died for it. Our forefathers lived for it. Let the sacrifice go on. Sarah. 